Hi guys, so today I'm going to be filming a dorm haul. This is just lots of stuff that I bought for my freshman year at college. I bought lots of things for my room and lots of decorating things and just basic living things. If you're interested in seeing what I got for my dorm, please keep watching. The first thing I have here is this comforter from Bed Bath & Beyond. And on the back, you can see that it comes with one sham, which goes over a pillow and then sheets and a pillowcase. And then this is the brand Anthropology. It's a five piece set and it fits a twin XL because the beds in college are a little longer. It's kind of hard to see, but this is what the comforter would look like. It's a nice dark gray color and it comes with one of those pillow shams. And so it comes with the comforter, a sham and a sheet, a flat sheet and a pillowcase. And I just really like this pattern on here and I also like gray, so I thought that went really well with the theme I'm trying to go for. I'll insert a better picture of it from the website so that you can see it better, but it's just a basic comforter, and I think that this style with kind of like fluffy strings almost is very popular, and I've seen a lot of comforters like this. Also to put on my bed, I have this square white fluffy pillow fur part and it's a pretty basic pillow size it's not too big and the back is just kind of soft and does not have any fur and I just think this would look really cute with the gray it is white though so hopefully it doesn't get dirty but other than that I really like this next I have two different sheet sets that I got at Walmart I have this kind of marl of light gray and this comes with a top sheet a fitted sheet and a pillowcase and this just seems like a very comfortable material and and it's also fits a twin XL bed and I definitely needed that so that I would have sheets that fit my bed properly and then this one is a little of a different style this is a microfiber sheet set also for twin XL and this is kind of a striped light gray pattern and this also comes with a fitted sheet a top sheet and just a standard pillowcase so I definitely needed two of those next I got these Serta perfect sleeper smart defense pillows and my sister's gonna get one of these but I just needed some more pillows especially since I have a pillow sham and just to use for sleeping in general now from home goods I have this gray rug that's actually a darker gray than the comforter and it has almost an identical not identical but like same kind of strings in a little of a different pattern and then the rug has tassels on the end and this is just really nice and long and seems like it would cover most of the floor that would be on my side of the room and I think that this would be very comfortable to walk on and it's a nice accent to the room. This is the rug all laid out. Again, you can see that it has tassels on the end and it's just this cool pattern with fuzzy strings and just like a plainer fabric in the middle and this is pretty long and looks like it would be great in my dorm room. Next I have a tapestry from Amazon and this is kind of a basic like palm leaf print. I'm gonna hang it right behind my bed and I just think this is really cute. I'll insert a picture of what it looks like on Amazon. It's kind of a really weird almost matte material but this will really look good in the room. Next I got a lamp and this is also from Marshalls and it has kind of a chevron board and then the lamp it has gold metal and then light gray color and it fits a light bulb and it has a stand at the bottom and I think this would be very helpful for putting more light on my desk if I'm doing homework or something and I think that this can also get very bright so it'll be very helpful if it's dark and this is just a nice addition to the room. Thanks for getting ready in the morning I got this impressions light up mirror and this is what it looks like kind of a tri-fold style and it has a button at the bottom that you can make it light up and you can tilt it and I think that this would just be really good for getting ready in the morning. I could just put it on the desk in the room and it's a gold color and gold is kind of one of my themes in my room. Also for makeup, I got this glass makeup organizer from Marshalls. The mirror was also from Marshalls. This is a Nicole Miller beauty organizer and it has this big compartment that I would put brushes in and also different compartments so I could put palettes and foundation and just other makeup in general and this is gonna really help organize all my makeup and make it easier to get ready in the morning. 
and I just think it's cute and also has that gold color. Next I got a few more makeup brushes since I share a lot of them with my sister and I just needed new ones in general. And this is the e.l.f. blush brush but I would actually use it as a contour brush because it's kind of angled and I believe this was like two or three dollars. And then I got the e.l.f. fan brush also that black air color and this is just good for highlighting. Also related to like makeup I got these two mini makeup sponges and these are just kind of like beauty blenders these are actually called makeup erasers but i have a similar one for marshall's that i just use for baking underneath my eyes and i just think that this would be good for that it's always good to get a new one then i got two backups of foundation the one that i'm using right now this is a new bottle the covergirl true blend matte made and this is in medium 10 and then another one that i like that actually has spf in it is the lasting finish 24 for our breathable long wear foundation from Rimmel and this is in the color 200 soft beige and what I like about this one especially is that it has a brush on it so those other makeup items were all from Target but also from Marshalls I got this Nanette Leopore makeup blender kind of like a beauty blender in this aqua mint color and I just needed another one of these a nice clean one and this was only four dollars at Marshalls then at Marshalls as well I got this Conair velvet touch hairbrush and it's black and gold and it was four dollars and I just wanted a new hairbrush for school. Then I got two different mascaras just to make sure I don't run out. And I got this $4 one, this Revlon Ultra Volume Mascara in Black is Black. And this is waterproof. And I don't know if this will be good, but they didn't have a lot of options. And then I think that this one will be very good. It's the L'Oreal Voluminous Butterfly Sculpt. And this is waterproof and looks like this. And this was also $4. Next I have a Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Palette because I need some highlighters for college. Because I share most of them with my sister. So I needed some that were my own. And this is kind of like a pinky color, an orange color, a goldish greenish color, and a purple silver color. And I think these are kind of neutral highlighters that will go with anything I wear. I have some lipsticks from Ulta for college. I have the Anastasia Beverly Hills Gloss in the shade Dainty and that's just this light pink corally color. Then I have the NYX Lip Lingerie in shade 8 and I'll link these down below and it's kind of this mauve dark rose color. Then another NYX Lingerie, this one in the shade 22 and this is just another peachy color kind of similar to the Anastasia Dainty Lip Gloss. Then I have the Anastasia lip gloss in the shade vintage. This is kind of a shimmery rosy color and I had a sample of this and I liked it so I bought it. And then the NYX lip lingerie glitter in the shade spirit. Then for storage I got this white bin. I know this acrylic material that has cutouts and little handles. This is from Five Below. They sell these a lot of other places, but I just got it there and I think it would be good for my makeup palettes if they don't fit in my makeup organizer and just other things to organize if it fits in the drawer of my desk. Now from the dollar store, I got this notepad that says hashtag goals and I just think this would be nice for writing lists and just writing things down in general. And all these things were a dollar each. Then I got these sticky notes, four different colors, and then this lotion. It's kind of a copy of Bath and Body Works and it's this vanilla brown sugar scent that smells really good. Then I got this LA Colors bronzer because I have one and I really like it so I wanted it for college. Then I got just two basic rolls of tape because I know that I'll be needing that. Then I got two different mugs. This one that has brown around the rim on the top and this blue stripes pattern and a kind of whitish handle. Then I have this basic gray one. Next I got these gray hangers. They call them flocked hangers but they're kind of like your basic velvet hangers and there's 25 of these and this was $10 and these are from Marshalls and I definitely need some nice hangers even though I do not have a lot of closet space. This will probably be all that I'd be able to hang. Also from Target, from the Bring In Room Essentials, I have this mini ironing board and as you can see in the picture, it can kind of go on top of a desk and it's not very big so it'll fit in the room and it'll make things easy to iron and I also like this color. Next I got this shark iron 
because I don't want to have wrinkly clothes. And this is the Shark Lightweight Professional Vertical Steaming. I just got this at Target. If it is a good one, this is just one of the ones they had. And I think it'll be good enough. Another thing that I got for my hair is this Hot Tools Professional Radiant Blue Digital Flat Iron. And it's one and a half inch. So it's a little bit thicker than the normal straightener. But I like that because I think it straightens your hair faster because you can use bigger pieces. And I think that this heats up to pretty hot. I bought this on Amazon and I haven't tried it yet, but I think that it'll be pretty good for getting my hair straight. Next, I got my own blow dryer. This is the Infinity Pro by Conair. I really love the, again, aqua and like mint, teal, ombre kind of color. It comes with a free little argon oil sample and this just seems like it'll be very powerful and will dry my hair pretty fast. And I didn't have my own blow dryer, so I definitely needed this. Also for college, when I like get out of the shower, I can wear this purple robe that I bought from Kohl's. It's really fuzzy and I love the color and I can't wait to wear this in college. Next from Walmart, I got two towels. I got this teal color and it has this cool pattern in it. It kind of looks like my rug. And I got a matching hand towel. Also in dark gray, I got the same type of towel and a matching hand towel. I definitely need hand towels and regular towels for showering in college. So I'm glad I bought those at Walmart. And then I don't really use washcloths, but just in case I bought this set of four. They're white and like gray. And these are like only like a dollar or two. So I figured I should buy them just in case. Also from college for a Nordstrom Rack, I got this yucky green colored jacket with lace. And it's kind of like a parka style. And this is just great for fall. And it was only like $18 on sale. It is the brand Sebi Collection and I just think that I'll need this for walking from class to class. Also for Marshalls I got this Adidas backpack. This was only $25 which is a pretty good deal for a backpack that's Adidas. I like this because it kind of has all the colors I like. So it has like you know, a marled gray and black pattern but it also has like electric blue and purple and the bottom has purple and the back is kind of padded and it has pockets that you could put a water bottle in. So yeah, I really like this backpack. I like that it has a lot of pockets. There's one up here that's kind of small. And then it has a bigger pocket here. And then two more bigger pockets that have like pockets within them. And a pocket in the back has the nice purple color. And even a pocket for a laptop. And I like this a lot because my last backpack was also an Adidas backpack, but it actually did not have a lot of pockets. It only had like two pockets. So I enjoy that this has a lot of room for all the stuff I'll be using in college. From the container store, I got this magnetic glass dry erase board. And it just says every day of the week so I could write my schedule or just different things that I have going on during the week. And from Office Depot, I got this set of dry erase markers and an eraser so that I could use that dry erase board. And this has like almost every color of marker that they sell and the eraser. And I think this was on sale for only like $5. So it was a really good deal. Also from Office Depot, I got a monthly planner for the end of this year all the way to the end of next year. And this just has every month and all the days in the month on a calendar. So you can write in what you're doing that month. And in the back it has a notes page, which I wrote my schedule on. And there's a list of important dates in the year, like holidays and things. And I really like that it's this matte black material and this will help keep me organized. Just for my daily homework and things to do, I got this other planner from Staples and it's also for 2018 and 19. I like that it's this marble material and kind of this aqua color that a lot of my stuff is. And the pages in the inside are just really cute and it has a little space to write what I have to do each day. And I just think this is cute and a necessity. I'm at Staples, these were also on sale. These paper mate markers. And I think these would be cute for writing in the planner. Then I figured that I would need a scissors so I got this basic Westcott scissors, also in an aqua color. Then I got my favorite kind of pencils, which is the Bic mechanical pencils with 0.7 lead. And these are the extra sparkly ones. And I just think that these work really well and don't run out of lead very fast. 
Then I got these pop-in retractable gel pens in this white color. Next I have this little pineapple decoration with white and gold from Target. Then I have this stapler. It's the Swingline 3-in-1 stapler set, also from Target. It's a light gray color. It comes with the staples it needs, a full pack of them, and then it comes with a staple remover just in case I need to remove a staple from something I stapled. Next I got this set of rubber bands from Target. I don't I don't know how much is in here, but it definitely looks like a lot. And also from Target, I got these cute assorted paper clips, and these have 280 in them. There's black ones, white ones, and some gold ones. And I think these are just cute, better than your ordinary silver paper clips. Then I got some envelopes, just in case I have to mail anything. And these were just on the list that my college sent, and I just bought these just in case I need them since the college recommended it. I also got this Peppermint Mocha EOS, just so I can bring a brand new EOS to college. And I think this is from the Holiday Collection, but it seemed like it would be a good flavor. Then I got this four pack of just basic black Sharpies, cause I think that I'll be needing these. Also from the container store, I got this white cup kind of a matte texture and it has little holes coming out of it and this is good for all those pencils and markers and pens I bought and then this could also fit pens just another one that matches that the rectangle shape and also matching from the container store is this holder that I would use for just like binders and folders and stuff like that and different papers to have a place to keep them in my room and these are very cute and I like that they all match next I got this Brita water filter from Target. It's this nice teal color. It looks pretty big. I'm pretty sure it comes with the filter in it and I believe that you can just use water from the sink and drink it like that and you can keep a lot of water in this because it is a big pitcher. Next I got some plastic cups. These are just kind of basic from Target and they are reusable. They're green and blue. I think all the greens are slightly different colors and then there's like this aqua color and this was $3 and I don't think I'll need a lot of cups but definitely a few so this was just enough. I got this nail kit set that is also from Target. It has a nail clipper, different nail files, a nail scrub brush, and just a few other things to take care of your nails and I think this is essential when painting your nails. Next I got this earring organizer and this is very big actually. Maybe more earrings than I have and as you can see it just has little holes so you can actually put your earrings through it and it folds kind of compactly and it's from the container store and this seems like it would even like fit in a drawer or just like sit nicely on my desk. I got this Sonia Cashew. It's supposed to fit makeup in it but I'm going to put my necklaces in it and it has this big pouch. This other pouch that I think is meant for makeup brushes and I could kind of lay necklaces in here and then another big pouch and another pouch on the other side and this is even bigger than I might need but I think that it's definitely worth it so that my necklaces are put away and all neatly organized. It's kind of hard to see but I got two of these clear bins that I can fit under my bed and store clothes. They have these little things on the bottom so you can actually stack them. And again, I got two of these and this is from the container store. Then I got this shoe rack. It's a two tier adjustable shoe rack. This is what it looks like. I think that this is good because I can make it longer or shorter depending on how much space I have in the bottom of my closet. And I definitely have a lot of shoes so this will be very helpful. Then I have this mint trash can. It's actually kind of big for my room just to put all my trash in. And then from Marshalls, I have this bathroom garbage put in my bathroom and just opens up and has a little thing you can take out. And this is a nice matte gray color and I definitely need this. I got these pop-up laundry hampers at Bed Bath & Beyond. There's a white one and a black one. I'm gonna give one of these to my sister, but it's good to have a hamper that is foldable so that it doesn't take up a lot of space. And it looks like you can even fit your laundry detergent in the front of it. Next I have this shower caddy from Bed Bath & Beyond. And this just has a lot of compartments for all the stuff I would need for the shower. They call it like a two-in-one caddy because it has extra compartments here and it's almost like a separate caddy in the middle. And this is just a nice gray color. I think this will be very functional. Next I got this broom essentials 
compact drying rack and in the picture you can kind of tell it's just a very narrow drying rack and I think this is necessary for things like leggings and certain bras and stuff that you don't want to dry in the dryer and you don't want to ruin them so now I have a dryer rack that I can hang them on and let them dry on. Next I have an extension cord. It's this nice mint one from Bed Bath & Beyond and this just plugs into the wall and only has like one thing you can plug in and because of that I got this extension cord from Amazon. It's just a basic white power strip that has six outlets and I'm not going to open it up but this is essential for college because um, there aren't many outlets in the dorm room. Next I got this box fan. It's white and it's in a box right now but it would just be good for putting in the window of my dorm room because it's going to be very hot in the dorm especially since there's no air conditioning and this is just another necessity. Then I got a energizer flashlight just in case there's like power outage or I'm going somewhere at night and my phone flashlight doesn't work well or something. And it's this red flashlight and it comes with some batteries and this will be useful if it's really dark and I need it. Then I got this can opener. Um, this is also from Target and I'm not sure how to use this but I think that this will be great for if I'm eating canned food in my room. And then I got this 36 piece tool kit. I'm not sure what, where this is from, probably somewhere like Home Depot, but this was a present and I think this is very useful in case something breaks in my dorm or if I have to build my loft on my bed and I think this is definitely necessary and I'm glad that I got it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you found it interesting to see what I bought for my dorm. I said it in my last video, but I'm going to Western Michigan. University and I have a dorm in the valleys and I'm also going to be doing a dorm tour so that you can see these things actually in the dorm room so you can see how they look together and thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!